Hi, are we late? <laughs> yeah, I found a bunch of stragglers on the L and we walked over from the stop. Thanks. Mike, the kitchen's over here. You can drop the bags off on the counter, I guess. Of course we brought snacks and drinks. Like we're just gonna raid your place? We're all students, no one has any money, so we'll all just share what we can scrounge, right? Okay. Line up the chips over here and put the drinks next to the cups. Oh, you're right. No, I did not forget the tape. Got it right here. Told you I had it. <laughs> well, listen, you're gonna love it. That's why we're all here. I mean, I, I told them all. You're a film major and you've never seen Casablanca. And there was a terrifically exaggerated general gasp from the crowd. <gasps> because as, um, let's see, uh, other film majors, classics majors, literature majors, and well, me as a theater major, we just cannot let that stand. No, it's not the principle of it, or because it's on any particular lists of can't miss or best ever. It's because it's a good fucking movie and you're gonna love it. I know you will, because I know you have good taste. We're friends, aren't we? Alright now, can I make you a drink? No, you're hosting, let me do this one for you. What do you feel like? Hmm, good choice. Alright. Uh, cups, 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 cups. Ah. Red Solo Cup. Drinking vessel of all good college parties. Just needs a little of this. And a bit of this. And then we'll fill it up with this. There you are. Cheers. Okay, you better have saved me a good spot. Fuck no, I don't care if I sit on the floor. I just want to be able to see. Alright. Last thing I need to tell you about this one. Keep your cynicism tamped down. I'll tell you why, because there are a lot of lines in this movie that are great, but sound like cliches. And that's because those lines are from this movie. They weren't cliches in 1942 before this movie came out, and so you need to listen to these lines as if they were new to you, got it? Yeah, show the screenwriter some respect. No, not like Play It Again Sam. In fact, you'll find that that particular exact phrase appears precisely nowhere in this movie. They say play it, and play it Sam for old time's sake but not play it again, Sam. I'm serious. That one being a cliche is a misconception. Shall we? Don't forget the tape. Okay, has everyone got a spot? Has everyone got the snacks and drinks they want? Because remember, this is a cinema classic. Our host has never seen it before, and we are here to make sure the experience is a good one. The dialogue is rapid fire and very important, so if anyone makes any unnecessary noise, they'll have to answer to me, understood? Good. We will stop for a bathroom and snack drink refill break in about 45 minutes. Someone turn off the music. Here goes. Oh, you're gonna sit on the floor next to me? Cool. You don't have to, you know, you're hosting. Okay, okay.
so? Aw, are those tears? No, I'm not making fun of you. I have some too, see? So it was good? I'm so glad. I thought you'd like it. Okay, strike up the band again, y'all. Yeah, it's getting late, and at this hour it'll take us a good 30 or 40 minutes to get back to campus and scatter. Thank you for hosting. Maybe we should do this regularly, yeah? You know, I kind of want to talk to you by yourself. Yeah, about the movie. Life. Whatever. We can let the rest of them get back to the station. Let me help you clean up in the kitchen. So, have you got one or two semesters left before graduation? Two? Well, after that I'm sure you'll be ready to take Hollywood by storm. Or at least the local film scene, whatever you can make of that. I know you want to do drama and angst and action, but let me tell you, you have a really good mind for comedy. Well, what makes me say that is the signs. The ones you made for all the doors in the apartment? Yeah, with all the doors looking alike, it made sense to label everything, but you didn't. Not as what the room was, anyway. Bathrooms, you put yes on. The bedrooms you didn't want anybody getting into, so those were no. And the linen closet. <laughs> Yes, that's what I'm talking about. You ought to keep that sign. Maybe, but probably not. It was perfect. Because at a party, who knows what'll be needed, but still, probably not that door. <laughs> you want one last drink while I'm organizing here? Yeah, I think I will too. It was a good party, but I'm beat. I'm sitting down now. Yes, on the counter. Cheers. To a great movie night. So, you saw what I meant about all the lines and it sounding like cliches? Even stuff you might not have heard before, like, What's your nationality? I'm a drunkard. That makes Rick a citizen of the world. <laughs> hmm. You had a favorite line, but you can't remember it exactly? How did it start? Oh, a few lines in a row. Something about making plans? Oh, right. <laughs> Yvonne, at the bar. She asks Rick, where were you last night? And Rick says, that's so long ago, I don't remember. Then she asks, will I see you tonight? And he says, I never make plans that far ahead. <laughs> yeah, Rick can be an impulsive sort of guy. But if he weren't, there wouldn't have been as much of a story, would there? He had been impulsive, he tried a life where he wasn't as impulsive anymore, and his personality just popped right back up to the surface, and that's where the movie happens. Hmm. No, you're right. There wouldn't be many stories anywhere if no one acted impulsively. Why? Hi. You're very close. Feeling a little impulsive? Me too. <laughs> what did I think of the kiss? <sighs> Very tasty. I made a good drink. <laughs> I 
Don't tickle me. No. So, where are you thinking of taking this? Uh huh. Yeah. To the no room. <laughs> would would I like to go to the no room with you? Am I allowed? Have I transitioned from party guest to? just thinking it probably wouldn't be the safest idea for me to walk to the station alone at this hour yeah I would love to stay <laughs> 